Hey everyone, Dr. Mary here. Today we are talking about the scoop on poop, why you should pay attention. Most of us don't enjoy talking about poop, but our bowel movements hold valuable clues about our health. Like a mechanic checks engine oil, we can learn a lot by paying attention to our stool. Changes in stool can be early warning signs of health issues. Your gut is an ecosystem crucial for digestion, immunity, and mental health. By tuning in to your bowel movements, you're listening to your gut. Take a moment to observe next time you're in the bathroom. Section two, decoding the do, types and textures. Understanding your stool is crucial. The Bristol stool chart classifies stool into seven types. Type one is hard lumps, while type seven is watery. Each type indicates gut transit time and hydration. Ideal stool is type four, smooth and easy to pass. Consistent extremes, consult your doctor. Section three, the Bristol stool chart. Your guide to digestive health. The Bristol stool chart is a visual guide that can help you determine how healthy your bowel movements are. It was developed by doctors at the Bristol Royal Infirmary in England and is now widely used by healthcare professionals around the world. The chart is simple to use. Just take a look at your stool and compare it to the seven different types illustrated. Each type is described in terms of its shape and consistency, making it easy to identify where your stool falls on the spectrum. Remember, the goal is not to obsess over your stool, but to use the chart as a general guide. If you notice any significant or persistent changes in your stool type, it's a good idea to consult your doctor. The Bristol stool chart is a valuable tool for opening up a conversation about your bowel habits with your doctor. Don't be shy about discussing these matters. Your doctor has seen and heard it all before and is there to help you achieve optimal digestive health. Section four, color me surprised, what your stool color reveals. Besides its shape and consistency, the color of your stool can also provide insights into your health. While the occasional variation in color is usually nothing to worry about, persistent changes could be a sign of something more serious. The most common stool color is brown, thanks to a pigment called stercobilin, which is formed during the breakdown of red blood cells in the intestines. However, certain foods medications and health conditions can alter the color of your stool. For instance, eating lots of leafy green vegetables can turn your stool green while consuming beets might result in a reddish hue. Iron supplements can make your stool black while certain antacids can give it a whitish or clay colored appearance. If you notice your stool turning black, especially if it's tarry and foul smelling, it's important to see your doctor right away, as this could be a sign of bleeding in the upper digestive tract. Similarly, bright red blood in or on your stool should never be ignored and warrants immediate medical attention. Besides stool type, texture and color, other signs can reveal your digestive health. Frequency, Smell and accompanying symptoms are key indicators. Sudden changes or difficulty passing stool. Consult your doctor. Exceptionally foul smelling stool may indicate an infection or malabsorption. Watch for symptoms like abdominal pain, bloating or unexplained weight loss. While most changes in bowel movements are temporary and harmless, Certain red flags warrant prompt medical attention. It's always better to err on the side of caution and consult your doctor if you notice anything unusual or concerning. 
one of the most alarming signs is blood in your stool. As mentioned earlier, black tarry stools could indicate bleeding in the upper digestive tract, while bright red blood could signal bleeding lower down, such as in the colon or rectum. Bleeding can be a sign of various conditions, from hemorrhoids to colorectal cancer, so it's crucial to seek medical advice right away. Another red flag is severe or persistent diarrhea, especially if accompanied by fever, abdominal pain, or dehydration. Diarrhea can lead to dehydration quickly, so it's essential to stay hydrated by drinking plenty of fluids. Unexplained weight loss, especially if accompanied by changes in bowel habits, could be a sign of a serious underlying condition, such as colon cancer or inflammatory bowel disease, IBD. If you experience any of these red flags, don't hesitate to contact your doctor. In recent years, scientists have discovered a fascinating connection between our gut health and our overall well-being. It turns out that our gut microbiome, the trillions of bacteria that reside in our intestines, plays a much more significant role in our health than previously thought. These gut bacteria are involved in a wide range of bodily functions, from digesting food and absorbing nutrients to regulating our immune system and even influencing our mood and behavior. When our gut microbiome is balanced and diverse, it contributes to good health. However, when our gut microbiome is disrupted, it can lead to a condition called dysbiosis, which has been linked to various health problems, including digestive disorders, obesity, type 2 diabetes, autoimmune diseases, and even mental health conditions like anxiety and depression. Factors that can disrupt our gut microbiome include a diet high in processed foods and sugar, chronic stress, antibiotic use, and lack of sleep. The good news is that there are many things you can do to promote a healthy digestive system and keep your gut microbiome happy. By making simple lifestyle changes, you can improve your digestion, boost your overall health, and even enhance your mood. One of the most impactful things you can do for your gut is to eat a healthy, balanced diet, rich in fiber, fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. Fiber acts like a prebiotic, providing food for the beneficial bacteria in your gut. Staying hydrated is also crucial for maintaining a healthy digestive system. Water helps soften stool, making it easier to pass, and it also supports the growth of beneficial gut bacteria. Regular exercise is another key component of good digestive health. Physical activity helps stimulate intestinal contractions, which can prevent constipation and promote regular bowel movements. Managing stress is also essential for a happy gut. Chronic stress can disrupt the balance of bacteria in your gut, leading to digestive problems and other health issues. Finally, don't underestimate the importance of regular checkups with your doctor. Early detection and treatment of digestive problems a key to preventing more serious complications down the line. During your checkups, be open and honest with your doctor about any digestive issues you're experiencing, no matter how embarrassing they may seem. Remember, your doctor is there to help you and they've heard it all before. By paying attention to your bowel movements, making healthy lifestyle choices and seeking medical advice when needed, you can take charge of your digestive health and enjoy a happier, healthier gut. Remember, a healthy gut is the foundation of a healthy body and mind. <laughs>